Hello, hi, hope you're in fine voice. Now, you may have come across a request on some of the voiceover websites for a Johnny Ive type of voiceover. And you've probably thought, well, what does that mean? Johnny is spelt J-O-N-Y and Ive is I-V-E. Now, in case you don't know, Johnny Ive is a, is a creative designer. He worked for Apple for many years. He was involved in the iPhone, the MacBook uh, uh, Pro, and he's associated with those sleek designs, very much kind of of the moment. But he's also got this amazing voice and he's been called in to do commercials for Apple particularly, but he's just got this amazing style and way of, of talking. And in fact, I've put some adjectives down, scribbled them down, just to try and give you an idea of what I think he sounds like and, and, and the, the, the tone of voice he's got. So I describe his voice as contemporary, cool, relaxed, aspirational, uh, inspirational, relevant, uh, those those sorts of things. I think you get a get an idea. Now, what I've done is I've put a, a link in the description underneath to his YouTube video. Uh, I think he's talking about the MacBook Pro. And when when you see it and hear him, you'll go, ah, right. Yes, I have heard that that voice, probably heard him. But maybe I've heard other voice actors sounding a, a similar way. So what the clients are looking for when they ask for this Johnny Ive type of voice is the tone of that, the sort of attitude, if you like, of, of that cool contemporary attitude that they're, they're looking for. So you could be a female voice and still do a Johnny Ive type of delivery. So don't impersonate him. When you're asked to do an audition as Johnny Ive, don't impersonate him, but bring your personality to that kind of style. I think that's the uh, that's really the key to to the success of that. So like I say, he's uh, he's a, a cool guy and and I think that's what it is. It's sort of being cool but not knowing it. That's that's a great way I think of of describing that type of that type of voiceover. All right, I hope that helps. Look after your voice and see you next time.